hello everyone today i want to show you homeless housing in chilavac it's not very far from our house so i'm gonna walk over there and show you and explain a little, little bit about it but before that i want to show you around our house we are living in a semi residential and uh, industrial area the people consider this area is a bad area but we never had any problem we are safe and also lots of security and police patrols happening all the time so people are here lots of them are paranoid um, you cannot live like that this is our house these houses are built in 1950s our one is built in 1957 this is our neighbor house and this mechanic shop this is the industrial buildings the gate is closed because today is Sunday otherwise during the week it's so busy it's too many cars going here and there and this is our neighbor's house these are the oldest house in Canada and this is the oldest neighborhood this is not a luxury area anyway in another video I will show you new houses in Canada I think somebody is living in this at the end of this uh, complex there was a house and uh, it was belongs to a health angels and they were running a drug business always cars come and go come and go to buy drugs okay this is a new building actually this is for homeless people it's called homeless shelter they are going to build 40 units for the homeless and another 40 units for emergency shelter and care center for homeless not only homeless anybody can go if you if they have any problems and know where to stay there are lots of homeless people around here and always have 24 hour security for everything so this is the end of our road here and this is the railway track and over there overpass you can see cars are going over there see somebody left a buggy there's a homeless person over there I don't know what he's doing oh I'm not filming you no I'm filming around yeah he doesn't want to film himself okay this is the homeless shelter these units will buy sea containers put together cheap housing 
but you won't believe that right i have another video how they are building these kind of apartments so this is the other side of the building you can see other building over there that's the another building for homeless people this place is run by uh, bc housing and they try to buy this small house too but the owner didn't allow here is the security is coming graphene security another drug guy is going on okay this is the shelter for homeless there are 40 units for homeless people but they are not homeless right now uh, i think they have programs for recovery addiction and also educational health service and uh, the government is trying to rehabilitate them and put back to normal life one day i will go inside and show you they are giving uh, food for them medical facilities also any help they needed to get rid of addiction so before it was open here all their friends come and deal with drugs with them so that's why they put this fence now nobody can like, go inside this is called rain city see another one a good thing that government's doing i hope they will recover and be a normal citizens so this is the chilavac bottle depot because of the bottle depot so many homeless people come here but they do you know they go around and collect all the Tins, cans, whatever you know, the bottles, and bring over here and get money and do drugs. But good people are coming here too. So you can see over there homeless people. I think uh, they have kind of. Uh, help sent over there that's why they are coming over here all the time i want to find out one day to go over there you can see the train going over the other side i think they are lined up for food or something see it's so sad on the long train running in the background
this is the back alley of some businesses there are lots of homeless people are here all the time nobody here today this is the uh, Indian restaurants it's called Shandahar good food There are some people over here. See the security here. This is a stone speed shop. As I told you earlier, this is a semi industrial area, actually, industrial area. So the owners of these properties, they brought this uh, container, I mean containers mean shipping cans and put it here and renting. So they charge about $300 per month. Hello guys. You see that big yellow, sorry, uh, big uh, willow tree, that's belong to us, that's our property. This is the behind the uh, back of the bottle depot. See, the, they put a big fence and you know, it's because these homeless people jumping and you know, always difficult to keep everything on proper order. So this is our property here, willow tree everything fence but tell you nobody jump into our house and nothing lost so far so uh, this is the back of that uh, homeless shelter it's fenced very well nobody can access and this is for the employee parking parking for the employees they cannot access without any uh, you know without no code or anything so nobody can access to this place there are security cameras here also uh, lights in the night Yeah, the homeless people cannot access from this side this is only for the employees you see there are more uh, container shipping containers this is also rented anybody can rent this place like uh, these containers and put their belongings see sad somebody sleeping here see this place for bicycles for the inmates the garbage place okay this is the other shelter for homeless people not only shelter rehabilitation housing it's still building this all container units they assemble all the containers together and make this big apartment now i'm going to the other side of the street this is our neighbor Stones speed shop. What they do, they renovate all old cars.
विंटेज का रेस्टोरेशन प्लेस सो एनी हाउ वी आर लिविंग इन अ वेरी कन्वीनियंट लोकेशन सो ऑल द शॉप्स एंड सर्विस यू सी दिस प्लेस इज फेंस वेरी वेल बिकॉज ऑल द होमलेस पीपल आर यू नो कम एंड ट्राई टू स्टील बट होनेस्टली दे डोंट कम टू अवर हाउस एट ऑल इवन फॉर अवर यार्ड they know these places are closed in the night so they try to steal from them i guess this is a new building it belongs to stone speed shop or car restoration company we have a tire shop here have a mechanic here mechanic shop i mean a car repair shop call uh, clear book transmission so sunday they are open restaurant chanda hat and this is a gas station over there so i'll already show you around our house and um, area a little bit so you know that um, this area is not the best area in canada but uh, it's a good place for us a uh, good location you saw how pe uh, homeless people live in this area and you know kind of sad so that's the life of some people i hope you uh, got some ideas about the area and life in canada uh, and see you in another video thanks for watching